Milpitas High School students walk to school in the rain, if prop. 7 passes, the students would have to walk to school in the dark for 3 months of the school year. Bay Area News Group file photo, Proposition 7 is the biggest waste of time on the November ballot. And that's saying something. Even those who hate the seasonal switch to standard time and daylight saving time should vote no on this ill-conceived ballot measure to make daylight saving time permanent, year-round. Click here for a complete list of our election recommendations. Get editorials, opinion columns, letters to the editor and more in your inbox weekday mornings. Sign up for the Bay Area Opinion Newsletter. Ad Choice Advertising and Red Invented by Teeds Assemblyman Canson Chu, D. San Jose, is the driving force behind the proposal to repeal the state's 1949 Daylight Saving Time Act. He says the current practice of springing forward on the second Sunday of March and falling back on the first Sunday of November is outdated and not beneficial to Californians. As a former member of the Berryessa Union School Board, he should know better. More than 6 million children attend K-12 schools in the state. If prop. 7 passes, those children will be walking, biking, waiting for buses or driving to school in the dark for about 3 months every year. On December 1st, for example, sunrise in the Bay Area would be at 8.05 a.m. instead of 7.05 a.m. On Feb. 1. It would be 8.13 a.m. instead of 7.13 a.m. The average school start time for California schools is 8.07 a.m. The National Highway Traffic Safety Administration reports that 20% of the total number of pedestrians killed in traffic crashes are children up to 14 years old. It also notes that more than 70% of all pedestrians killed in traffic accidents occur when it is dark. Nothing is more important to parents than the safety of their children. California has no business putting their lives at greater risk, even if year-round daylight saving time means youth sports teams can practice later in the evenings before it gets dark. The potential for disruption for California businesses is also problematic. Changing to year-round daylight saving time will mean airlines have to change their flight schedules for the state. No estimate exists on the potential cost, but when Congress extended daylight saving time by a month in 2005, the Air Transport Association said the price tag for just lining up travel schedules with international flights would be $147 million. It would also create disruption and confusion for California businesses trying to link up with their Midwest and East Coast partners. The final reason to oppose the ballot measure is that California doesn't have the power to make the change on its own. President Lyndon Johnson signed the Uniform Time Act into law in 1966. The legislation gives states two options, operating on standard time throughout the year or observing daylight saving time from the last Sunday in April to the last Sunday of October. That was later amended to the current time frame in the 1970s in an effort to conserve energy, Arizona and Hawaii are the only two states operating on standard time, year-round. It's impossible to predict what Congress would do if Californians pass Prop 7, but it should be clear that this is an issue that should be dealt with at the federal level, with an eye to creating as much uniformity and as less confusion as possible. Chu cites statistics showing that there are more traffic accidents when drivers lose an hour of sleep in the spring and a slight increase of heart attacks, as well. The consequences of permanent daylight saving time are much worse. Vote no on probe. 7. Sponsored content 5 ways Amazon has changed how we shop by the retailing behemoth Amazon continues to dominate the world of online retail, and in doing so, it's transformed the way we shop and buy. But, you might also like HSBC Advance Credit Card, HSBC Singapore HSBC Bank Air Conditioning now finally affordable in Singapore, Cool Air Mahathir wins 71% public approval 3 months into, Nikkei Asian Review Mahathir says water sold to Singapore should cost 10.
Nikkei Asian Review Most Photogenic Beaches on Instagram Far and Wide 3 Questions to Ask Before Purchasing Insurance Are You Ready? Home Will Khalil Mack Be a Raider This Season or Not? MercuryNews.com Bodies of Missing Wife Daughters Found in Colorado MercuryNews.com Aretha Franklin Rejected Trump's Request to Perform at MercuryNews.com Nicole Kidman Reveals Painful Reasons She and Tom Cruise Didn't Have Biological Children Chris Watts Lane Family In the Early Hours An Emotional Conversation China and U.S. Seek Summit Breakthrough as Tariff War Escalates Nikkei Asian Review Support Your Baby's Immune System with Right Nutrition AbbottFamily.com.sg Designing Your Favorite Beer From Farm to Glass at SolidWorks Social Media Goes Bananas Over Trump's Apocalypse Now Blunder Bodies of Missing Wife Daughters Found in Colorado Abe in Need of Landslide to Keep Grip on Party Nikkei Asian Review Sign Up Sim Open House Briefings and One-on-One -on -one Consultation Part-Time Full-Time Degree Program